Today's video is brought to you by Squarespace. Stay tuned until the end for a special offer. Hello my loves and thank you for watching today's oil painting time lapse featuring my most recent painting titled Reverie. It's for the upcoming 100 Trees exhibition at Modern Eden Gallery in San Francisco opening April 9th. This is my first major full-scale oil painting since I started art school six months ago. After becoming a student, most of my personal work had become comprised of small realistic studies or master copies to help supplement my learning. So it had been a while since I had created a large, polished fantasy oil painting from scratch. Immediately upon starting this piece, I realized how much my creative process has changed. I typically don't spend too long in the planning stages because I'm eager to get to painting as quickly as possible. But this time around, I had learned the importance of patience and preparation from my time at school. So instead of rushing, I took my time and created a more fleshed out digital mock-up that could help serve as a blueprint for my painting. By the way, if you'd like to see a 60 minute tutorial of this piece where I go over my digital mock-up process in more detail, along with hundreds of hours of exclusive content, please check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash happy deartist. Instead of going straight to color, I planned out the piece in black and white first so that I could focus more on designing the composition through values, contrast, and lighting. Then I added color after the black and white version was all complete. Lighting was another key component that I rarely thought of before, as I normally just used a general soft ambient light for all of my pieces, uh, but this time I really wanted there to be one clear light source that created dramatic shadows and highlights that can fully bring out the emotions of the visual narrative. I'm also painting a bit slower, taking the time to carefully glaze different layers of color in order to create more luminosity and depth, but also letting myself be a little more confident in adding some texture with the paint instead of always trying to make things look perfectly smooth and airbrushed. Technical aspects aside, I think the most noticeable difference between my pre-art school self and now is my eye for error. It's getting increasingly difficult for me to look at my older works as I can now point out all the mistakes in anatomy, lighting, composition, etc. 
But with this piece, I also put a bit too much pressure on myself to prove that I have overcome those mistakes. And in the pursuit of perfection, I kind of lost the whimsy and open-mindedness that is so crucial to fostering creativity. My teacher even told me to shut off my atelier brain as I was carrying this piece to the finish line because I was so fixated on finding the correct way to do things that I forgot how to improvise. Sometimes with art, the most magical moments happen from listening to your intuition rather than following a strict rule book. Like with everything in life, it's important to strike a good balance. And I'm still currently in the process of learning how to balance the rigidity that is needed to improve my technical skills with the playfulness that is needed to nourish my creativity. Anyways, that about wraps up today's video. Thank you all so much for watching and for listening to me ramble on. I hope I made some sense. Um, if you're interested in checking out this painting or adopting it, she will be available through Modern Eden Gallery in San Francisco. I'll leave all the information for the show and for the gallery in the description below. And as usual, my never-ending sale in my shop is still going on, so if you want 20% off your order of prints and originals, just enter the code HOLIDAY at happyd-artist.com. And if you're interested in learning more about how to paint and draw, I have lots of art educational content on my Patreon page, including exclusive video tutorials, step-by-step -step photo tutorials, live streams, podcasts, and even surprise art gift boxes. All available at patreon.com slash happydartist. I'd love to have you join my Patreon family. I wanted to quickly thank Squarespace for sponsoring this video and for supporting my channel and the art community. I've actually enjoyed using Squarespace for four years now to build and host my online shop and website. So whether you need a domain, website, or online store, make your next move with Squarespace. Start your free trial today at squarespace.com and visit squarespace.com slash happydartist for 10% off your first purchase. Also, if you want to check out more artworks, works in progress, and just random daily artist adventures, feel free to check out my Instagram and you can follow me at the handle at happydartist.